before I came to Christ, I was uh, insecure in many areas. Um, but I think one thing that uh, set me free was uh, the love of Christ. Uh, understanding that um, grace is a gift and that we could do nothing to earn it and it's something that was freely given to us. I was a very heavy asthmatic. I was hurt. Um, I was hurt by uh, people that I've put all my trust and all my love into. Um, uh, before I came to Christ, I was very fearful. I was, I was very, I was very afraid. Uh, uh, back in the world, I was um, hurt. I was unloved. I, was, I felt rejected. Because I had asked uh, a lot of people on what their perspective is on my life, I had followed through. But yet, even as I followed through, it got me nowhere. Um, which caused me to go off and um, not really hurt others, but um, I had so much unforgiveness towards myself that I started abusing and hurting myself. It was something that bounded me my whole life, for 28 years of my life. I tried to cover it with false joy towards my family giving them comfort and giving them love, not knowing that I was in desperate need of the same thing that I was giving. I would put on a, an act or a certain character just to try and fit in with certain people and uh, trying to gain friends, trying to gain numbers. I carried around an uh, inhaler, ventilant inhaler, and this was something that I used to joke around with and call life. People knew that, people around me. And to be honest, I thought I would be dead by now because of the many suicidal attempts and thoughts that had played my life. But it wasn't until I, um, you know, late in the later years, seeing my sister give her heart to the Lord, um, sister as in friend, um, seeing her give her heart to the Lord, I was like, wow, I want what she has. As faith was ministered onto me, it was then me, it was up to me to actually have faith in Jesus to see if this would work. I did say a secret little prayer to myself with the Lord and said to him, if you can take this away from me, you know, like, that's, that would be awesome. Like, that would show me that his power is real. My life was ruled by it. But, um, yeah, when I came to Christ, that's something that he definitely set me free and he still is setting me free. Every day he's renewing my mind. So after finding out about the faith and asking the Lord in my prayer. I went home, I moved the faith, I grabbed all my puffers, chucked it in the bin. And I said, Lord, if you're real, if this is, if this is it, I, I believe. When I found forgiveness in Christ, he taught me how to forgive others. Two months went by and I was still in awe. I was still like, trying to figure out if this, if this can be real. Like, still thinking that it was going to come back because I had it for 20 years, so I still kind of had this thing where it might come back, but... But now coming to Christ, I was set free from a lot of those insecurities, uh, the fear, the confusion. I was now able to understand why I was placed on this earth and to know my purpose in serving Christ and Seeing the person who I am today, I never thought I could be that kind of person seven years ago. I've been walking over four years in the faith now and I'm still free from it. I've, I've found freedom in Jesus because freedom is Jesus. Freedom is Jesus. Freedom is Jesus. Because freedom is Jesus. Freedom is Jesus.